You guys may remember a couple weeks back, I did a speed run to get a mini jukebox, which was a challenge in the Stardew Valley Cup. And that challenge, as we saw, was like very, very hard. It took me like two hours and like 40 minutes to complete or something like that. It was really difficult. But there was one yet that was even still more ridiculous, I thought. And that was to change your appearance at the Wizard's Tower. Change your change appearance? Your That's not gonna happen. That's not we gonna need, happen. You need four hearts. Now, if you don't know, the way do you change your appearance at the Wizard's Tower? there's two ways to do it the first way is to get four hearts with the wizard and the second way is to complete the dark talisman side quest the dark side talisman side quest requires you to like complete the community center and then do a bunch of other stuff so already that's like way too long so today i'm going to try and get four hearts with the wizard start a new speed run from scratch and try and get four hearts with the wizard and change my appearance and that will be my time so i haven't really planned out the route for this yet i figured i would just do it now i don't even know how hard this is going to be quite honestly but I don't think it should be too difficult because the wizard is pretty much open at all hours. He's not like Gus, who is closed at noon. I think that should be a little easier, though the wizard has a lot harder loves, which I think will be a hurdle to jump over, but we'll see. So the wizard has a couple loves, but they're all pretty hard to get. First, he's the universal loves, which are obviously like pretty unattainable in a new run. Then he has purple mushrooms, solar essences, super cucumbers, and void essences. All of his loves feel super insanely hard to get. And and almost unreasonable to ask, which is why I think it might be a good idea to just like go for a bunch of universal likes. I'll probably just grow like a bunch of flowers, but you need to consider, right? We need a thousand friendship points to get to level four and each liked gift gives what? 45 points plus talking gives 20. So that's 65 friendship a day. So we're going to visit him 15 times. Now, if we visit him on his birthday, that can actually cut out a couple of them. The wizard's birthday is on winter 17. Okay, so that should be our end date for everything. You know what? This might be a good plan, right? First day, we go to Pierre's. So we buy a bunch of tulips, right? And then we just hope that rain waters them all. And then we just sleep for all of spring. And then we start doing this in summer. We should be able to buy enough tulip seeds, though. Tulip bulb costs 20 G. It's 25. So that should be doable. I feel like that might be the best option, right? How does the wizard's tower even open? 6 a.m. Okay, so at the crack of dawn. So then it's just getting there every single day. So you need to make 10 trips to the wizard and then his birthday which shouldn't be too hard all right so this is his birthday right so we give three gifts this week three of our 11 so then we do one two now we've done five and then that's three weeks so we don't start even gifting until fall 15 because that minimizes decay forest purple mushrooms may spawn oh that's a good idea i didn't even think of that all right let's try this out baby who knows it seems easier but like anything could happen and if anything else we know that it's gonna be a world's record so that's all that matters all right all right, let's start this one out. Three, two, one. Okie dokie. So first thing we got to do is clear the farmland for 15 tulips. And we have a, some time to spare anyway, because Pierce doesn't open until nine and we only need to hoe and water uh, 11 spaces. One, two, three, four, five, nine, 10. All right. And that should be 12. All right, away we go. Um, You know what? I'm going to get a chest just in case because I forget how tulips work, honestly. I forget if they're like, what's that other flower that spawns in like a million pieces? I always forget. I mean, I like, have the time, so I might as well, quite honestly, you know? All right, well, we have time. I don't know what to do with the time, though. Uh, Open this. Give me a purple mushroom. Nope, okay. <laughs> you had to try. Okay. See, I did not need to sell my parsnip seeds. Even now I have like too much money. All right, we should just be able to place these down and then head to bed. All right, away we go. And now we literally just sleep until the fifth. Did I move the bed, but it's fine. Worst things have happened in this world. Now we just have to hope we get three rain days on top of that one. <gasps> nice. Okay, it rained on the fifth, so we have to go out a following day, but that's fine. That slightly changes the plan, but it's fine. We got a nice clutch rain day right at the beginning of the season. Oh my god, that was the most scuffed water I've ever seen. Also, I want to make sure that debris does not destroy my poor little tulips. Put that right here, just in case. And now, we need to enter from the bus stop sign to proc the community center cutscene after 8pm. So, we have some time to kill. Might as well just collect this stuff. What do I do with this extra time? Um, I guess I'll cut this down, just in case it becomes relevant somehow. I don't know how it would be, but it never hurt to have more wood, I guess. And flex my cool animation canceling skills. All right, let's get this so you just have to move one frame. Boom. Okay, now we just have to go read the scroll. And then we've watered th four days so far, so we only need two more rain days. If not, we're gonna have to water once. We're, I'm pretty sure we're gonna get at least one more rain day. 
<laughs> up through here and then we should we don't have to start until like the end of fall i need to move that quicker but it's fine it's all good i'm not stressed about this this seems pretty easy honestly we just need two more rain days and we should be set okay it rained ah no not the emotes all right we need one more rain day come on baby oh there we go okay they should all be ready to harvest now i'm gonna wait just in case i did my calcs wrong until the 27th okay that should be good that everything should be able to harvest now okay i forgot about the scene oh and it's a good thing i crafted a chest baby because there is so many things here no i would not like to adopt this cat varney okay <laughs> okay all right so since one of these is silver this is actually gonna take less time than i thought because silver increases quality by like 1.25 so i think i'll probably have to take one less trip to the wizard now all right now we sleep through all of summer which i think will be a time save i hope i don't know i guess hopefully the silver will make a difference or we could give him the silver on his birthday which would be even better okay we'll do that let's only go nine times as opposed to the 10 that i thought so we should have two extra i always whenever i do a speed run all i can think about it is through the lens of the townie where they're like guy moves in plants 12 flowers sleeps for like five months and then wakes up and just starts befriending the guy who lives in the outskirts of town who like maybe banged the shopkeeper's wife like we're not sure like the rumors must be insane about me i run 11 minutes right now which i don't think is that bad or i guess i'm the first person to ever do this so this could be really good or really bad i guess i'll never know all right i'll sleep through this week and then i can start gifting did i read the wizard's letter yet no but i can do that on the way there thank you for reminding me though i definitely would have forgot otherwise all right Start of the new week. Let's go, baby. Oh my goodness. Oh, there's a mushroom tree there. I think I opened up the wizard's letter in there. I'm going to cut this down in case... Can it? Doesn't have a chance to give you a purple mushroom, right? Uh. Well, that day is... That chance is not happening today. Okay, never mind. Oh my god, the debris on this farm is ridiculous! Oh my god, this is insane! Get me out of here! Even if there is a purple mushroom that spawns on this farm, I don't even want it. I don't even want to go looking on this absolutely insane place. Let's go, let's go, let's go. To the wizard's place. Alright, I think this has got to be the quickest route there, right? Might as well if she has, see if she has anything for us. She didn't. Might as well just go on Fridays and Sundays. Can't hurt. Because what if she has like a purple mushroom for us? Okay, we have to talk to him for the extra 20 points. Okay, dope. Now we head back. Run, 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 run. We need to remember that Winter 17 is his birthday and we'll give him that on his birthday. We've given him one gift so far and we only need to give him nine and then his birthday gift. Oh, I can't move the bend here, which is annoying, but it's fine. Ah, I hate that I keep emoting instead of clicking one. Uh, one. Oh, I got foraging one? Okay, well, that's definitely a time save next time. I'll take a screenshot on Friday, see if anything spawned. See if there's any purple mushrooms over there. Can't hurt. Oh, there's one on the farm! I've seen it. I see two! Okay, great. That saves us a couple trips. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. There's one down here. Okay, poggers. Victory Royale, let's go. There's another one up here, I think. Yeah, there we go, there we go! Great. Okay, so we have... Currently, we have 65 points with the man. This will save us definitely some time. So we have to give one on his birthday. A loved gift on your birthday gives how many points? It's 80 times 8. 480 plus 65. 500. Easy. Okay, that's halfway. Nope, nothing. All right. And this silver one is going to multiply its value by 1.25. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. 80 times 8 is 640. Oh, well. Shows that I do a lot of math in my Stardew Valley streaming career, but I never said I do it well. Okay, currently I have 170 points with the wizard, right? Loved gift on birthday is going to give me 480. 100, what's 175 plus 480? It's like 650. No, that's not right. It's 640 plus... Dude, this is so... What is 640? No, wait. Okay, I have... Wait. What am I trying to figure out? This is going to be my third life gift. What, 65 times 3 is 170. I asked for 480, right? It's 640. Okay. So I gave him 3. I'm sorry. 65 plus 65 is 30, 130, right? So plus another 65 is 195. Plus 640 is 835. So then 835 minus 1,000 is 160. 160 divided by 65 is 3. Okay. 
So we only need to make two more trips now if we include his birthday. I don't, okay, <laughs> just trust me, just trust me, chat, just trust me, it makes sense. I promise it makes sense. Chat is just saying random numbers, they have no clue what's going on. Trust me, it makes sense, it makes sense. Just trust me, you gotta believe in me. I'm pretty sure. Okay, what's 125, what's, okay. What is 45 times 1.25? That would be not a lot. Okay, wait, hold on, guys. No, 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 I actually got this. I actually got this. Gift on birthday is 640. Plus that silver quality gift I just gave him is basically 60. So let's say 700 points, right? We have 300 points left to go because 1,000 minus 700 is 300. 300 minus 65 minus 65 minus 65. 65 plus 65 is 130. Then plus another 65 is 195. So that gives us a remainder of 105. So that just means we just need to give him a gift on his birthday and one more loved gift. Yes. Okay. It makes sense. You just got to trust me, chat. You, you you guys will see. And I'll be laughing in the end. Oh, wait, but plus the talking to. I forgot about the talking to him. I don't even think I need to give a two more loved gifts. I think I just need to give birthday gift and I should be good. I like the people who are just like, sounds good to me. No clue what that guy just said. But yeah, go off, man. Either way, I, I, I've got this. This might work. I might have to give him one more gift. If so, it's like a half a second time loss, but it's not a big deal. Okay, no, we need to give him one more loved gift. That's what I figured. Yeah, one more liked gift. Actually, we really only were short like 40 friendship points. So, but I'll just give him another loved gift. I think if I gave him a loved gift instead of a liked gift that one day, I would have had it. So I kind of choked. It all makes sense, guys. See, you just saw I have three hearts with the man. The proof's in the pudding. Watch. Just you wait, chat. It's all about to come together. Once I give this last loved gift, haters are about to stay angry. See, four hearts. Go, 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 go. Change the appearance, change the appearance. Oh no! I forgot about the 500 G! I forgot about the 500 G! I forgot you needed money for this part. Oh my gosh. Literally choked. This is the walk of shame. This is so embarrassing. And Pierre isn't even open. This is just so embarrassing for me right now. I might just stop streaming Stardew Valley. Okay, well, it would have all worked had I not been a complete idiot. Come on, open the doors, 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 open the doors. Come on, man. Come on. There we go. Okay, let's go. To be fair, nobody else remembered that you needed 500G. Not a single other person remembered that. Okay. Time! Woo! Okay. Easy, easy, easy. Did I forget to get the 500G? Yes, okay. That was a mistake. That did I also forget to sell the seeds. Yes, that was also a mistake. Did I also do some math that might have been so confusing that I confused myself? Yes. And yet, still a world record. So I can't really complain about that, now can we? You know what might be smart? Wait until summer to grow the crops, right? And then on all the days you have to water, you can also check for purple mushrooms. Isn't that smart, guys? What's the easiest flower to grow in summer? So it will be the poppy. All right, tulips were always a bad idea. It was always poppies. All right, let's run it back. I believe that we can pull it through this time. Poppies are not a universal like. Yo, good call. All right, so everybody hates poppies, so good call. All right, what about Summer Spangles? All right, Summer Spangles was always what I thought was the best option. I guess it doesn't have to be a flower. It can be any, any vegetable. What's the quickest summer growing crop? You know what? Radishes might be the play. Screw the, the flowers. It might be radishes. Radishes all the way. Trust in radishes, chat. Well, how many, how much does radish seeds cost? I need to look that up. 40 G. So that means I can get 12, which is cutting it really close, but it's fine. Cause we're sure to get some purple mushrooms along the way. All right, radishes it is, baby. Radishes are the way of the future. Let's go. Three, two, one, go. Sleeping until summer. I honestly think that when it becomes summer, it might be better to just like physically look instead of screenshotting because screenshotting doesn't pass time and we need time to pass while we're looking. Oh my God, it's so weird to get the uh, tool reminder today on the first day of summer. 
I don't know how many we're gonna get, but might as well. All right, now let's look for some purple mushrooms real quick so we can let time pass. I see nothing here, unfortunately. That's kind of an L. And give me at least one purple mushroom. Oh, wait, no, it's down. Oh my God, I'm throwing so hard. Okay, and there's nothing down here. Big fat L. Okay, I think I'll still get there before Pierre opens. I think I'm a swift enough. Okay, sweet P, which is nice. Well, I canceled that freaking horribly. Today we can also do the community center day. And this way is nicer too, because we get to do it all in like one day. I guess now that I think about it, I probably should have screenshotted and then also just done the community center thing like right before this, but it's fine. It's fine, mistakes were made, we're growing. Okay, let's go baby. Now we just gotta go get the Junimo scroll, plant these babies and then sleep. And then just hope it rains. But summer rains a lot. And I'm pretty sure isn't there like two guaranteed rain days? Oh no, yeah, the community center cutscene can be triggered at 8. Okay, that's an optimization I can do in my next run. I've learned a lot. Okay. Ah, might as well plant here just in case. Gotta maximize our chance for getting silver quality. Alright, so so far we've gotten one water in and we need six. So we need five more waters. And I need money. Oh yeah, that too. I should probably remember that this time. Alright, it's been a week and it hasn't rained a single time. That's kind of worrisome. That's just a little- Okay, it rained once, so we just need four more rain days. Yay! Okay, that's another one. Three more rain days. Okay, two more rain days. Okay, I think we are gonna have to do two days of watering, unfortunately. That's just the way that things go. I'll wait until tomorrow. Okay, and then I'll go rain I'll go water today. Oh. Okay, nice, 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 nice. Okay, it should be done today, but let me go check. Yeah, they're all done. Okay, dope. Alright, nope, five, please. Okay. One, two, 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 two. Oh, that's a gold quality too. Nice. Oh, I need to check my mail. Need to check my mail. There we go. Do -do 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 -do. Okay, I need to screenshot. Okay, I'm looking around and I see no purple mushrooms. Great. Okay, good to know. Great. All right, I'm gonna go give my first thing today because I already op I already started the day, so I might as well go to the wizard's castle. Can purple mushrooms only spawn on the farm in fall or something? I feel like I've been getting really bad luck. Okay, come give him this guy. All right, so right now we have 65 points with the man. We need to remember that. 65 points and we need a thousand, lest we not forget. And we did get one gold quality radish, which is kind of nice. Okay, we got the 500 Gs, so that's good. At least we won't choke on that, so we're guaranteed to do better. Purple mushrooms only spawn in fall? Huh, interesting. Okay, that kind of changed my strategy a little bit. I'm get First day I'll go out is on Friday, and then I will take a screenshot and take a quick look around. Okay, I see the owl statue, but no purple mushroom. Okay, no sweat. All right, let's go. That would be 130 points that we have with him right now. I need to keep track of this, otherwise I will forget. And then we'll get a scenario last time where I'm trying to do some like voodoo math at the very last second. All right, check again. We're getting mad mushroom tree luck. Okay, a purple mushroom did spawn on the left side. I don't think I'm gonna go get it today, but it's good to know. I think sometimes purple mushrooms can spawn from this thing. No, they cannot. So what's 45 times 1.5? 20, it's like the 67 on top of the 130. Let's say that's like 200. All right, so, cause we're gonna give him the gold quality one now. So we definitely have 200 cause plus the talking to bonus you need to consider. 67.5, so that's 87.5, 130. So that's like 210 points, right? Plus the 640 for loved gift on the birthday. That'll be like 200 plus 640 is 840. So then 840, fill in the gaps, that's minus a thousand is 160. So that's three more liked gifts, easy. And then the birthday gift. So if we can get two more mushrooms, that would save us time. That is the only thing that could save us time. I'm pretty sure I did the math right there. Okay, give him one of these. Great. So now I don't even think another pro mushroom would even save us any time. No, because I think we'd still be short regardless. So it doesn't even matter now, I think. Don't quote me on that. All right, so I'm gonna sleep until the last day of fall now and then go out and give him a gift then and then also check to see if any purple mushrooms spawned. I probably should have just only screenshot on the last day of fall, but say la vie. We're almost done though. I think sub 25 might be possible. I did make a couple mistakes. I'm not very good at this game at all. I just have a lot of knowledge. Okay, you can also check the cart tomorrow and then we'll check the screenshot here. 
Okay. Oh, okay. Three purple mushrooms. All right. Dope. Well, now we're only giving him purple mushrooms, I guess. Here we go. Okay. Go ahead and grab this. Then there's two up here, which I don't know if are necessary, but might as well grab them. All right. And now we have a cleared path for when we need to go back. I believe winter 17 should be our last day. Come on, come on, come on, come on. All right. Now we just sleep until the 17th. In case I did the math wrong. No, I guess you sleep to the 16th, because that saves you like a couple seconds, because I'm pretty sure I need to give at least one more loved gift. Ah! I don't feel like switching to my pickaxe. I'm not good with the freaking numbers pad. That's the hardest part about getting good at this game. I honestly think that the hardest part of speedrunning this game is switching between your tools quickly. Okay, this is getting really close. I mean, I might as well try with the birthday strategy, but... I mean, like, at worst, it's going to cost me, like, what? How long does it take to sleep a day? Five seconds? Like, who cares? If this run is costed by five seconds, then it wasn't going to be a good run anyway. Also, to be fair, I have just realized that I am playing on the forest farm, and we were forced to play on the beach farm, which is definitely something we should all take note of, but it's fine. The only reason I'm able to succeed is because I'm playing on the forest farm right now, but it's okay. It's okay. Don't even worry about it. Like, this is, like, in optimal conditions. This is still taking me, like, 30 minutes man if you play on the beach farm it's gonna take even longer no okay we got even one more loved gift that's fine i guess i probably should have played on the uh the beach farm but it's okay for technical accuracy to the challenge but it's not a big deal it made this just way harder now that i think about it i did jukebox percent on the standard farm though i guess it wasn't didn't make as much of a difference there no, I don't think the sub-25 is possible. Oh, I mean, it's possible. I just don't think it's possible this run. I don't think it's possible for Shawnee do. Sub-26? Now that's, that's negotiable. I'm gonna assume I don't even need to talk to him and just go for it. Nice, okay. Time. 25, 25, 55. Pretty good. Four minutes time save. It's probably what I would have got the first time if I remembered the, that you had to sacrifice money there. But you know what? We've learned a very valuable lesson. And that is that the next time that they do a Stardew Valley Cup, they need to think of more reasonable challenges. Because this took 30 minutes on its own. And I was playing on the forest farm. It's just like, but I guess it wasn't as hard as I thought it would be.